Now a new show is saying see you later, skinny minis, and hello to bigger and beautiful. The reality dating show is featuring average folks finding plus size love, and it has Bachelor Luke loving life these days. Fox's Jill Dobson has more. <laughs> Folks are finding there's more to love on Fox's new plus-size dating show as Luke Conley continues his public journey to find love. What kind of woman are you attracted to? The 26-year-old real estate investor is getting noticed a lot more on the street with fans giving their opinions on why they like the show. I usually get approached more by women that are watching the show. Uh, you know, guys just give you a high five. Women are like, oh, you're so sincere and you're so sweet. And, uh, you know, they're just kind of blown away by that. But, uh, yeah, it hasn't been like overwhelming people aren't like uh, knocking me over and stuff but uh, it's been fun getting recognized out in public Hello, ladies. the more to love bachelor is happy to be the one to break down barriers in the tv dating world it's cool to be the guy that's uh you know the pioneer bachelor uh you know that's a bigger man that's doing this more to love show uh, i'm really flattered to be the guy that's that's there um yeah, it's been fun oh <laughs> Another major bonus of doing a show like this is getting to save on his dating costs. I feel that doing this show has added you know, at least a couple of years to my life because I tried to imagine how long it would take me to meet this many women and go on this many dates and as extravagant as they are. Probably take me the next couple of years and, and God knows how much money. So uh, it's just kind of great that uh, you know uh, they they foot the bill and, and I get to go on these dates with these amazing girls and you know, and, and try in uh, hopes of trying to find someone special. He is a hottie. And as far as giving away any secrets about how he narrows down the search for his one and only. It's safe to say that uh, I was looking for someone special and uh, I was shocked by what I found. Love the battlefield. <laughs> Tune in for more Luke, more dating and more to love Tuesdays on Fox. In New York, Jill Dobson, Fox News. Ooh, a little kissing going on little there. Little kissing action. Kelly is a battlefield. Golly. I know. That girl said it right. <laughs> <laughs> but this show is definitely pretty controversial today. We're definitely talking about this revolutionary new show. It's recently locked on, um, launched on Fox. More to Love is fashioned right after The Bachelor or The Bachelorette yeah. format. However, it's enlisted, of course, plus-size women who are all looking to find their dream come true. And so this show is getting applause, and it's kind of, you know, getting some raised eyebrows. Mm -hmm. um, I think people are really enjoying it because it's giving these women a positive experience. And, you know, yeah. it's like they're really experiencing love for the first time. And some of them yeah. are going on their very first date, having their very first kiss, all that kind of stuff. So that's really special. Mm -hmm. However, I'm thinking, is this really going to be beneficial in the end? Because then he's all going to leave them. I mean, there's only one winner. Well, that's true, but I mean, that's the way, you know, these women, if they are familiar with The Bachelor, The Bachelorette, these other dating shows, I mean, they know right. going in that Luke is going to choose one woman. So it's hopefully they've got to kind of be up for the fact that most of all but one are going to kind of get rejected. Absolutely. But unfortunately, they all come in with these really sad stories. So they're all thinking, oh, I'm making a connection with Luke and he's got, you know, he's he's watching out for me and he really gets me and he knows me. But then, mm -hmm. I mean, he's going to reject him mm -hmm. and that's not good. I mean, so I don't know if that's going to help their self-esteem eventually or if that's yeah. going to, you know, make them feel just like more confident in who they are and, yeah. you know, they'll embrace the dating world after this. Well, we hopefully don't it's been a confidence boost just to just to be on the show sure. just to I mean you, these women have to be very confident to just put themselves in the position you know I, I say they know what they're getting in for there Kel maybe maybe they do but we want to know if you think they know Luke. what they're getting in for <laughs> I'm hanging on some look this morning, absolutely. <laughs> on our website, fox43tv.com, we have a poll set up that you can go to and let us know what you think, whether this is a good thing for the girls or if it's if yeah. you're saying no, saying this is not good. So the let cute, us know. The, go the, right now. The cute and cuddly thing just is not getting by you today, huh? It's not getting by you. It's not getting by me. He's still a man. It shouldn't get by you either. <laughs> it could be exploitative or it could be good self-esteem. Yeah, so, so, well, you know, know. And, and I mean... That, I can see where people will will root for this kind of show sure. because the women on this show are much more like most women yes. than the women we've seen in other Absolutely. shows who are, you know, really skinny and, and perfect. Absolutely. Um, but then I can see those saying, why should these women, they're still being separated out. Right. Uh, so I'm very interested to hear what folks have yes. to say coming up later. Can't wait to get some feedback. I'll be back bringing it to you. All right. We're watching Luke, huh? Huh? <laughs> Find that nice smile. All right, we got to get over to meteorologist John Cash in the Super Doppler 10 Weather Center.